also sworn in was newly elected Shinju Mayor Ann Gao, who has been listed as a suspect for embezzling public funds and making fraudulent deductions from the payrolls of her legislative assistants. Now that she's not a legislator anymore, she no longer enjoys immunity granted to lawmakers. A lawyer thinks the prosecutor's next move will be to try to detain her. Gao said she would bravely face the case. If they go ahead with a second round of questioning, she will no longer have legislative immunity and the prosecutors will have more flexibility to detain her and can enforce this. According to past practice, if a county or city councillor is involved in fraudulently appropriating their staff's pay or there is a risk of collusion or destruction of evidence, the usual approach from the prosecution side is to detain the person. I will bravely face it. We absolutely respect and will fully cooperate with any investigation and judicial procedures. For Shinju City, I will not waste a minute or a second. And I will do my best to work for the Shinju City administration. Right after her inauguration, Gao went to the city council to congratulate Xu Xiu Rei on his re-election as council speaker. Gao also promised that after taking office, she will tackle the city's traffic problems, the delay in sewage construction, as well as review of budgets for public works, so that citizens of the Windy City will get a sense of renewal under her administration.